papers or was she left behind? It does not matter. No, it matters. I want to think she could trust her team in a fight. She's beyond that question now. begun to turn her into one of the Reaper's creatures. I'm sorry. Can we set off that bomb? Not without a detonator. Commandos would have had one. We've got to find it.
Rahila, there wasn't even time to say goodbye. Few can break the Reaper's hold. Rila's will was extraordinary, as was her love for you. We left her to die. Rila made her choice, and it has reminded me of what is truly important. Why I swore I'd lay down my life. What is that? Valer? The code demands an Ardat Yakshi cannot live outside a monastery that no longer exists. What are you doing? I'm sorry, Shepard. By the Justicar's code, there is only one way to save Valer. Mother, no! My daughters, you were all so... Let go. What are you doing? Fulfilling the code. By throwing your life away? I won't kill my last daughter. You won't have to. Valer? I'll stay here. Home. No matter what's become of it. Without a proper monastery, I could have left any time. I don't need a building to honor my own code. And if the Reapers return, they won't take me alive. I promise. Then, the code permits you to stay, as you are. Once this war is over, and if I am able, I will visit, as a Justicar should. I meant it when I said the galaxy needs you against the Reapers. You were right. It's past time I joined your battle. I'll fight in your armies, Shepard, once I speak with Falaire. I'll be waiting. Not for long. Thank you, my friend. Everything's taken care of down here. Bring in the shuttle. Right, Commander. I'll just follow the smoke. Commander, I'm pleased to hear the Ardot Yakshi situation has been put to rest. Should I guess you're our contact inside Asari High Command, Counselor? I'm merely here to convey the gratitude of the Asari people for concluding a difficult, sensitive mission. The next team of commandos we were sending to the monastery are now en route to Admiral Hackett instead. Farewell, Commander. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on Bitcoin. Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted.
Everybody was fighting the Rachni, trying to push them back through the relay. Finally, the Krogan were turned loose and stopped them. I see. But when the Krogan rebelled, we had to deploy the Genophage to stop them. Wasn't the only rebellion. A thousand years later, the Geth revolted against the Quarians. That was a whole other war. Then along came the humans. My own people tangled with them for a while, and now, to top it all off, we've got the Reapers. What about you? The Ouroboros fought the Densorin. The Andoromai conquered the Vanduma, and the Jatil turned against the Jah. So, I guess nobody really ever gets their act together. The Sinriel claimed to have found the path to eternal peace. What happened? The Ditika preferred war and wiped them out. I hope you guys had alcohol. Some of the crews... Samara's the kind of sword. It's a brilliant tactic, when you think about it. When has that ever mattered in war? sense to me. It ensures you never run out of cannon fodder. Eliminates any local resistance. And for every soldier you add, your enemy loses two. The one you the M35 make It's got heart, you know? Oh, come on! The M44 Hammerhead is vastly superior. Come on, that thing's made of tissue paper. At least the Mako can take a few hits. I'd hope so. That thing handles like a drunk rhino. No agility whatsoever. More like a bull that can climb and climb for days. It only climbs because of its stupid, vertically aligned mass effect field. Jump or stick. No speed. No lateral movement. Hey, with a cannon like that, who needs to move? If you want that, why don't you just stick with the old M29 Grizzly? Hey, I love that tank. <laughs> you would be one to love grizzly bears, Mr. Vega. <laughs> Okay with the shuttle? Just double checking the inertia dampener coils. It can be twitchy in these UT 47s. But don't worry, this bird's been rock solid. I appreciate your dedication. 
Good work, Lieutenant. Thank you, Commander. You can count on me. So, before this war, you must have done something to relax. Sure. I remember back when the Hawking was based out of Arcturus and I was just a fighter jock. There was this observation deck overlooking the main flight paths. You could watch every ship taxi in and out. When I was alone, I'd turn off the auditory emulators and just watch them drift by in silence. You know, there are views like that on the Citadel. Next time we're there, you should take some shore leave. Clear your head. I don't know. Maybe. Take some time off on the Citadel, Steve. As a favor to me. If you put it that way, how can I say no? You can't. Picking up chatter from a Cerberus squad engaging the supply depot. Engaging the scientists? And if I'm reading it right, sounds like more troops are on the way. Okay, set us down and get out of here. I need these scientists alive.
gone. For now, but they'll be back. Uh, you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'll walk it off. Uh, save my life one more time and I'll start owing you. This one's on the house. Shepard, this is Dr. Bryn Cole. She's in charge here. Tell me what's going on. Intel says you're Cerberus. We're all ex-Cerberus. Scientists, mostly. Civilians? Call us refugees. If we hadn't run, we'd be dead. Now, the elusive man doesn't mess around. If he can't control it, he'll destroy it. The brain trust here has to be a significant loss for him. You had to know they were gonna find you. It's a pretty smart bunch. We covered our bases. But the elusive man is one tenacious bastard. Time to evacuate. Agreed. Just need to get the AA guns on the roof back online. Cerberus is jamming them somehow. With those guns down, Cerberus will just blow our escape shuttles out of the sky. Might be the network link. I'll check and meet you upstairs. Jacob, you should get that wound looked at. I'm good. I mean, I will. Commander, I should see to my people. Join me upstairs when you can. This guy Jacob's an old friend of yours? He worked with me to stop the collectors. So sorry. Your partner was brave. He wouldn't want you to crumble like this. She's right. We're getting out of here alive. I promise. Thank you. Commander Shepard, Dr. Gavin Archer. We met on Prophet Over. That's one way of putting it. Yes. Well, after you took my brother to Grissom Academy, I tried putting all that behind me. I don't suppose you have any news from there. I've heard rumors the Academy is in trouble. I was at Grissom Academy. Cerberus tried abducting the students, but David's okay. Oh, thank God. Commander, you have no idea what that means. It's a little late to start worrying about his safety now. I never stopped. I know you think I'm a monster, and you're right. Not a day goes by where my dreams aren't haunted by what I did to David. All I can do now is hope that one day he forgives me. I have to go. And I'm not even gonna pretend it was good to see you again. I understand. But Commander, thank you for saving David. Both times. Make sure those samples from Project Mia get out on the second shuttle. I've already dropped one box. My hands were shaking so hard. We're going to make it. What's the status of the guns? Still waiting. I have my best people on it. How many scientists are here? 43, plus research assistants. How did so many escape? When you fear for your life, there's a lot you can do. 
Bryn, I can't possibly dismantle the genetic amplification components in time. I'm sorry, Dr. Boehner. It's important work, but right now you need to tend to your family. Wait, there are families here? Children? Holy shit. This escape will have to be carefully executed. I'd hoped. We tried so hard to make sure it wouldn't come to this. What's the news? Can't tell. Only know I can't fix it from here. I'm going to the roof. Cerberus landed a shuttle there a couple minutes ago. You in? Jacob, you're injured. I'll fix the guns. No way. These are my people. I'm going. Just because you survived one suicide mission doesn't mean you get two. Ah, uh, fine. But I'm gonna talk you through it from here. Cerberus is probably jamming the satellite link. Radio me when you found the controls and I'll give you the override code. Will do. Let's just get the hell out of here. Dr. Cole. Got a moment? Of course. Thank you again for that. Come on. God damn it, Marcus. You want the elusive man to find this? Chuck, I'm in here. Hey. You okay? How have you been? Give us a minute. This is crazy. I didn't think I'd ever see you again. I know the feeling. So how'd you become a gun for hire? Long story. It was an opportunity I couldn't resist for people I came to care about. You seem good. You look good. These are great people. Defending their ideals? I like it. I think I found what I'm meant to do. I should focus on getting these people out of here. You bet. Let's get to it. I'm not willing to die to save this data. Let me. I'll push it and meet you at the shuttle bay. This is some kind of poison tailored to Turians. No, no. I okay. told you that we should have gone to Sanctuary. Elusive man really wants these guys. They are brave, but misguided. And now they may all be dead. Hostiles, 